principle here for you. If you can conceive it, you can achieve it. What does that mean? You have to be able to visualize something. You have to be able to visualize it. Is that true? Is that true? How, who here? Who here knows the perfect, the perfect something, and you sent a spouse or a brother or someone to the store to get it, and they came back with not it. <laughs> Who's had that happen? Somebody tell me a story. I need to hear an example. Somebody have an example? Yes, ma'am. Um, I sent my mom's boyfriend to store like, tortillas. Tortillas. This is a very simple thing. Except yeah. a man, no, it's very complicated for men. <laughs> <laughs> store to buy butter. We come back with margarine. <laughs> <laughs> Do we worship Satan or what? What's going on? <laughs> they say, no, this is not it. Go back. We go, we get, I cannot believe it. Not 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 right. right, so we come back. Hey, here it is. Go back. That's <laughs> uh, unbelievable. Now, if you can, if you can conceive it, you can saying so if you can, if I don't know what kind of butter you're talking about I cannot achieve it so what I'm asking you to do I'm asking right now your action step I need you everyone to write down one person not me because I'm a man bear pig not me one person that you want to study one person that you want to conceive the a mental idea based upon their success what's one person that you can study just one if you can't Get to them. I didn't know anybody successful, so I had to read the book. But what is one person? Everybody here has one person. Somebody. Is it Oprah? Maybe not. I love Oprah. For me, it was Russell Simmons. For you, it might be, I don't know. But everybody here has some, one person that you can study. Maybe it's a pastor. Maybe it's a successful family member. Maybe it's somebody that you read about. I'll tell you what, I got. What was the movie? Um, uh, Blindside. Was the movie Blindside? Yeah. Did you leave maybe just a little bit more encouraged about life? Just yeah. a little bit, you know, maybe just a little pet in your step? You have to be able to touch something. You've got to have something. you got to put something in. Because if you listen to the radio, what kind of songs are on the radio? Is it general rule? Are people having, like, good relationships on radio songs? Is Beyonce like, okay. Are we having, like, really, really realistic, you know, uh, uh, are, they, are they giving you practical financial advice on the radio? And they play every time I come around this, you know. <laughs>
Next, Andrew Carnegie. Andrew Carnegie was the world's wealthiest man in today's standards. He could buy Walmart twice. Okay? He could buy Walmart twice. Two out of every hundred purchases in the world are made at Walmart. Just so you know that. Okay? So he's pretty wealthy. He says, put all of your eggs in one basket and see that no one kicks that over that over your basket. Okay? Put all your eggs in one basket and see that no one kicks over your basket. I'm going to ask you this real quick. What is the basket you should put all your eggs into? What's that? <laughs> the iron one. What is what is that basket? You, yourself, you, you, Natasha, you, and yourself. You're the basket. Put your eggs. Put all your capital, all your money, all your time, all your energy into making yourself the best person you can be. That's what it's about. It's not about putting your eggs in this company's basket and then buying some mutual funds over here and then maybe putting some of your money and putting it here, but it's putting it all investing it in yourself.